Okay, guys. Unfortunately, the few gloves I have left are all dirty as hell, but that is what it is. Some stuff out of the way. Uh, so what we're going to do is today we're going to pull the heads apart. Um, I also got to take the crank out of there, but because that rod bolt is being pain in the butt, I think I'm going to clean heads today. So... <clears throat> take out well, two. Uh, let's see. Try to head. How much of this can you guys see? Okay, good. You can see all of it. Perfect. Um, I think these are 18s here. There's a, a fit of three eights driving here and pull these off. Uh, what do we want to go for? Uh, let me get a wrench on this bolt and see if it wants to come out. I don't think it does, but we will try. Was this an eight? No, even smaller. Mm, let's see what do we have. Oh, no, no, that's an eight too. Uh, this is like a six. No, it's not even a six. Is it like a five? Five and a half? Five and a half doesn't even grip. Okay. A five then? Okay, yeah, five. Uh, let's see. I might want to hit this actually with some heat so it doesn't break off. Because if it broke off, I don't have a welder right now, so. That's going to be a problem. That's going to be really a problem. <laughs> this other one that's stuck, I'm not sure if I can get two bolts on it, but we're going to try. Okay, pull that off for now. Put that on to this okay, and then where's our lighter? Thought maybe I just threw it in here. Mm, let's see. I must have just I just touch stuff everywhere. Who knows? We will need this to make the cams. Where did my lighter go? Okay. I almost need like a second cart already. Didn't I've only had this for a couple months. So I just kind of try this on and look for anything. Lighter. Okay. You guys can see this, right? Yeah, you can see. We're going for this one right here. I'm not going to put a crash engine into it because, you know, it's aluminum. So I just want it to extend just a, just a little bit, get a little bit of heat on it. Smoking a little bit, so let's see how it does. 
normally yes I would use electric tools but because this is what seized in there I don't want to right you know I don't want to destroy the threads but it's actually coming out really easily so I could probably get an electric tool on it right now yeah it's coming out really easily thank god So the threads aren't boogered. Okay, there we go. It's it's barely warm. Like I can touch it. It's barely warm. So it's fine. Uh shit. Now this one. This one's gonna be a real pain. Because there's no actually yeah okay I can set it up like this. The problem is at least a good amount of it is stuck out, so I might be able to get two bolts just on there, two nuts on there, sorry, and then uh, pull it out. Uh, we got a little bit of grime in here. Actually, while we're waiting, while I think about what I'm gonna do, I'm actually hit this a little bit of. Let that sit. I'm actually going to do that with these too. I'm going to sit on the ground. two bolts and then use the lowest one to pull it out. Um, the problem is I need to make sure I have the right thread pitch and this also didn't break off super clean. So, oh, huh, well shit. Okay, I stand corrected. Okay, so we might just be able to. Okay, they're tightened down on each other. Uh, I think this would be a 13. Uh, let's see, that's a 10, that's a 9, or is that a... That's an 8, that's it. That's a 13, right? Yeah. Okay, so I need to tighten these down on each other a little bit. So... Only just, okay, now this should pull the stud out. Okay, it is turning, but I don't like 100% how it feels, so I'm gonna give it a little bit of heat. Okay, that's pretty good. Like, it didn't feel the smoothest when I was trying to do it. Like, it was, it was moving. Like, the stud definitely got like a half a turn, but I wanna be a little careful. <clears throat> the last thing I want to do is buy C heads. Uh, Buying even a U set ain't it's not gonna be cheap. I already had to buy a new block as you guys saw uh, in the last couple of vids, which is sitting over here. It's an MAC block, so like a 05 and up block. Um you, you can put four valve heads, three valve heads, two valve heads right on, it doesn't matter. But yeah, last thing I want to do is buy a pair of heads. And like I said, I don't have a welder right now, so And we're, that's enough heat. We don't need a lot, just a little bit. And then it's coming out, but it's mm, like it's moving, but it's not feeling the greatest. Which is why I'm trying to go slow, because I don't want to take the fucking threads out and have to drill and tap, and I don't want to have to do that shit. It's so annoying. And I haven't had to do it yet, so. Not on my B heads and not on this and not on these heads. So I don't I don't plan on doing that. 